Oh, hello, it's me, Looney Lenny, your favorite magic clown. But today, I'm not doing a magic trick. Today, I thought I might like to share a story with you because I love books and I love reading and I love reading to my daughter. So I thought maybe it would be fun if I read to you this story. This is The Sunflower by Lola M. Schaefer, pictures by Donald Cruz. I used to read this to my daughter when she was little. It's actually kind of like a little poem. I don't know if you like poetry, but sometimes a poem is like a story, and this is just like that. So I hope you enjoy my rendition of This is the Sunflower. This is the sunflower, tall and bright. that stands in my garden, day and night. This is the blossom, yellow and round, that crowns the sunflower, tall and bright, that stands in my garden, day and night. These are the seeds, black and brown, found in the blossom, yellow and round, that clowns the sunflower, tall and bright, that stands in my garden, day and night. These are the beaks, sharp and strong, that crack the seeds, black and brown, found in the blossom, yellow and round, that crowns the sunflower, tall and bright, that stands in my garden, day and night. These are the birds full of song that use their beaks, sharp and strong. to crack the seeds, black and brown, found in the blossom, yellow and round, that crowns the sunflower, tall and bright, that stands in my garden, day and night. Here are a few seeds scattered round, spilled by the birds full of song, that use their beaks sharp and strong, to crack the seeds black and brown, found in the blossom, yellow and round, that crowns the sunflower, tall and bright, that stands in my garden, day and night. Now, the sun warms the moist ground that covers the seeds scattered round, spilled by the birds full of song that use their beaks, sharp and strong to crack the seeds, black and brown, found in the blossom, yellow and round, that crowns the sunflower, tall and bright, that stands in my garden, day and night. And these are the sprouts, rich with life, that grow and grow and grow until a patch of sunflowers tall and bright stands in my garden day and night. I hope you enjoyed my reading of This is a Sunflower and I hope you like sunflowers too because I love sunflowers because I'm from Kansas. <laughs> there you go. I'm not just a New York City clown. Well, I hope everybody's having a great time, and I hope you enjoyed hearing my story. I know some of my cats here did. They came all around to hear the story. They probably would like to eat the flower or the sunflowers, but mostly squirrels and birds eat sunflowers. You can eat sunflower seeds too, but I wouldn't recommend growing any sunflowers out of your belly button or anything like that because it would be such a pain to have to water them every day and then, you know, you have to take a bath or a shower and then the seed would maybe wash out and then the flower wouldn't grow and then you wouldn't have as good of a story as the one I just read to you. So have a great day. Looney Lenny, out!